All tablet handlers, please collect your tablets at this time. Once again, for our team members, all tablet handlers, please collect your tablets at this time. Thank you. Be back soon. Have your Sail and Sign card in your hand to be scared. A kind reminder that smoking, eating, drinking, and the use of cellular phones is strictly forbidden during the safety briefing. What are your two numbers? I will now review the locations of our muster stations. Muster station A4 is in the liquid lounge, deck 4 at the front of the ship. Muster station A5 is in the liquid lounge, deck 5 at the front of the ship. That's our main theatre where all the shows take place. Muster station B3 is in the Horizon restaurant. Deck 3 at the middle of the ship. So if you just head to the front, you'll be able to pop down to the Horizon dining room on deck number 3. Muster station B4 is the Panorama Casino. Deck 4 at the middle of the ship. Muster station B5 is the lobby by the Lobby Bar. Deck 5 at the middle of the ship. Muster station C4 is the Limelight Lounge. This is our comedy club, deck 4 at the back of the ship. Muster station C5 is the Ocean Plaza Cafe, deck 5 at the back of the ship. Muster station D3 is the Vista Restaurant, deck 3 at the back of the ship. Deck 3. So we continue walking. I'm coming. Yeah, station D3. I believe it. Welcome to D3, have one card for Kevin ready. One card for Kevin. They said no phones. Yeah. Yeah, no Cigarettes and cigars must be extinguished and the disposals provided for this purpose in public areas. <laughs> yeah. Under no circumstances, the cleaning is stringent is what it seems like. Or hot ash never be thrown overboard, as this could blow back into the ship and start a fire. Never, ever leave smoking materials unattended. Unauthorized heating appliances such as cup or mug warmers or clothing irons in the staterooms are prohibited. Objects with an open flame such as a candle are also strictly forbidden. Any such items will be confiscated. The discharge of any garbage into the sea is prohibited. All garbage must be disposed of in appropriate bins. Secure all personal items to prevent from going overboard. Violations of these requirements will be reported to the appropriate authorities and may result in civil or criminal penalties. Thank you so much for your kind attention. Once again, for all of our guests on board, Please kindly proceed to your master stations at this time. 
Our team members are all over the ship to guide you, and of course, all of our guests must attend as it is maritime law. Thank you, lovelies. Here are the so there's a guy in here that was a doing B2B. Uh, I guess the customer is supposed to come on board for the B2B, but they just changed last minute. They're like, no, we're not doing it. And that's what screwed everything up. So everyone wound up having to come off the ship and go for customs again and then come back on. So that sounds like it's completely the responsibility of customs. Mm -hmm. So once again, to all of our guests on board, please kindly proceed to your master stations at this time. Please make sure you have your sail and sign card in your hand to be scanned. Very important, we do need to take attendance of all of our guests and all guests must attend the briefing. So please kindly head to your master stations at this time. So the group of guests on the Lido deck I see your burgers and your ice cream. You gotta put them down. We got seven days of food. <laughs> Come on down to your master stations at this time. We're ready and waiting for you. Thank you. I said hello. Hello. Hello and welcome to master station D3 and D4. Uh, a quick reminder. This drill is something that we must do by maritime law. This is a guest safe briefing. Of course, it is something we must do by maritime law. With that in mind, the sooner we get this done, the sooner we can start the fun. Yes? Yeah. So now that we just get this done quickly, we must work together. We must work together to get this done quickly. With that in mind, if there is anyone in the room, if you think, if you're not sure, maybe you're like, oh, did I scan? Did I not scan? When out, check. If you're not sure, if you can't scan when you came in, it's better to double check and us to scan you twice, then for us to miss you, and then have to call your name and embarrass you in front of everyone. So I'm going to say yes. So is there anyone in your room, if you think your card was not scanned, maybe you came in early, maybe you came in a side staircase, you did not think you were supposed to go down, maybe you snuck in, maybe we had two kids on each other's shoulders or trench coat. Okay, so, if you think your card was not scanned, wave your hand in the air right now, I'm going to come and check you. Okay, so, now, quick check. As I said, this safety briefing, we got to do. But we can do it quickly as long as we work together. With that in mind, whenever there is an announcement from myself, from the cruise director, from the captain, we do ask for you to make sure you keep the talking down. Put your phones away. Put your phones away. So, Carnival Panorama family, at this time, just a kind reminder to please proceed to your muster stations. So, a big thank you to all of our guests that are already at the muster stations. We're almost there, but we do need all of our guests to be in the muster station before we are able to continue with our safety briefing. For those of you that have not had your sail and sign card scanned, please hold it up in the air and our team will be able to assist you. Also, this announcement is for Kyle Baser. Once again, Kyle Baser. Please head to the guest services desk on deck three at the front of the ship. So Kyle, please head to the guest services desk at deck three at the front of the ship. Thank you. Okay, so, as Emma just said, in case of emergency, we would do a full roll call. As this is a mandatory safety briefing, I must simulate that right now and double check the people who have not checked in. Now if I call out your name and cabin number, it's not a problem, just come see me, we can check you in, it's fine, okay? If I call out these names and cabin numbers and these people are not here, then these are the people who are holding up this drill. Moving on. Now, I am from, my name's Tony, I am from the UK. With that in mind, I do apologise for any of the names I'm about to mispronounce. Looking down this list, there's going to be a few of them. Okay, here we go. Are you ready? So, in my station D3, in my station D3, if I call out your name or cabin number, please make yourself known. We've got Stolenrek, cabin 1455. Banjuri, cabin 1457. Wisen Whiskey, 
Cabin, yeah, I swear I'm not making this up. 1473, Johansman. 1483, James. 2424, Lopez. 2453, Cohen. 2465, Rana. 2477, Parker. 6432, Wong. 6437. Yeah, just guys, make sure you come to the front. Make sure you know me. <laughs> Carnival Panorama family, good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. This is Carlo, your captain speaking from the piloting bridge. On behalf of the officers, staff and crew, it is my pleasure to welcome you on board the beautiful Carnival Panorama. I also want to extend a special warm welcome to our past guests. We appreciate your loyalty and thank you for cruising with us again. At Carnival Cruise Line, we are completely committed to the safety of our guests and crew and to preserving the environment. Our goal is to be the industry leader in this area, and your support of our policy and initiative is greatly appreciated. Shortly, we will commence our mandatory guest safety briefing. International law requires all guests to be gathered at their assigned master station. The safety briefing will last approximately 10 minutes. During this time, your attention and cooperation are essential. Thank you, and I wish you a safe, fun, and memorable cruise. Thank you, and welcome on board. So will the naming and shaming resume? Yeah. <laughs> I'm waiting to hear Simon <laughs> 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 I think they're going to get order for Captain. Okay, we just got a couple. <laughs> Guess who? It's Emma, your cruise director again. At this time, you are now at your assigned muster station. In the event of a real emergency, or whenever the general emergency alarm signal is given, you must report to this location immediately with your life jacket. At this time, I have to give you some important safety information, so please may we have complete silence. A low-level lighting system will be automatically activated, guiding you to the nearest exit. If your muster station is not accessible, crew will guide you to an alternative location as directed by the captain. If your child is 12 years of age or younger and is participating in a youth activity when an emergency arises, you must first collect your and your child's life jacket from your stateroom before proceeding to your muster station. The youth staff will escort the children to their muster station to be reunited with their parents. For this reason, it is important your child wear the wristband provided to them at all times. In the event of an abandoned ship order, any remaining children will be escorted to the lifeboats by the youth staff and will be under constant supervision. For our guests requiring special assistance, a special needs team will help you in the event of an actual emergency. In the unlikely event that it is necessary to abandon ship, guests requiring special assistance, women and children, will have priority in boarding. Members of the same family will board the same lifeboat. Guest master station personnel will now demonstrate the correct and proper way to wear your life jacket. First, place the life jacket over your head with the reflection stripes facing outward. Perfect. Now, Pass the strap around your back and engage the buckle in the front. Lovely jubbly. Adjust to a snug fit by pulling the free end of the strap and tie the collar string. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Each life jacket has a whistle and a light to attract attention. For the benefit of families travelling with infants weighing less than 33 pounds, a member of our crew will now demonstrate how to put on an infant life jacket in one of our designated areas. In case of a real emergency, you will be led and assisted in boarding your designated survival craft by guest master station personnel. If you need any additional information, please ask one of our team members at the end of this safety briefing. Okay. So... When the drill is over, I do ask us this, okay? In the room, I want you to remember one thing. I want you to look at the people around you. Look to your right, look to the people to the left. In case of emergency, these are the people that could save your life. In case of emergency. 
With that in mind, please show some consideration to each other. When it comes time to exit in the dining room, don't push past each other, don't shove each other, okay? Make sure you li we are on the ship just for the next seven days as one big team, yes? Yay! Yeah, so of course teamwork makes the dream work, so please, as again, show courtesy to those around you. I do, we are, what we are going to do is when it is time, we are going to let those with any walking disabilities, wheelchairs, exit first to give them a head start ahead of you, okay? Now, that doesn't mean it's a race. That doesn't mean when it's your time to go, you're going to try and run and beat them to the finish line. No, because we're going to help each other. So do ask that you do remain seated, remain where you are, until Emma gives us the final all clear. And trust me, oh wait, final all clear, because you'll say, the drill is now complete, it's not yet though, okay? Once the drill is finished, we're going to head up to the deck, deck 10, where we're going to have a massive, and I mean massive, sail away party. This is the first ever seven day cruise on the Carnival Panorama. Are you excited? We are going to have a lot of fun. We have 500 guests who were on last week and they had so much fun, they stayed on for this week as well. So with that in mind, again, we're going to have a great time. The sailway party tonight is going to be up on the Lido deck, on deck 5, straight after this. So I'm going to say yes. Yes. Now I am a strong believer the louder we are, the more fun we have and the fit cooker this is go. So with that in mind, it is coming up to the holiday season. I figure what better way to pass the time Rather than sitting in an empty room looking at your phones, which you should not be doing anyway, you know who you are. <laughs> Why don't we sing a song? Okay, I've got to say, the more towards the back I was getting, the more in tune you're getting. So the people at the front, okay, a bit out of time, eh? Okay. Now, again, for those who, for those who haven't met me, my name is Tony, I'm part of the fan squad. Uh, I'd like to give you guys a little tips and advice. Remember, you guys are here for a great time this cruise, yes? My, one of my favorite words is yes. And that's like saying yes to new experiences, trying new things, treating yourselves, having fun and taking new chances. So I'm going to say yes. My leg fell so asleep during the safety briefing that I was limping more than you as we were walking out. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. And I'm like, well, at least I look like I belong in the early leaving crew. <laughs> Is the casino one of the muster stations? Yeah. That's stupid. <laughs> Oh, we're allowed to oh. go there, yeah. even with the mustard still happening? Yeah, you can go ahead. Okay, okay cool. Thank you. You're welcome. Ladies and gentlemen, we are still hanging out here for just a couple more minutes, all right? We are almost done. Just hang tight, enjoy the comfortable seats, and we will let you know when we can release, all right? Thank you so much. <laughs>
Hello, Carnival Panorama family. Our safety briefing is now over. All guests are now released from their muster station. So all guests are now released from their muster stations. It is very important to have follow all of our safety guidance, such as our smoking and environmental guidelines. Thank you for your cooperation, and we hope you enjoy all the fun we have planned for you. So right now, head up to the Lido deck, deck number 10, outside by the main pool, because we're going to have a massive sail away party. We're going to get this cruise started in style. It's going to be the best cruise ever. So head to deck number 10 on the Lido deck. I want everybody there, because we're going to get this started the right way.